Hey guys, Marcel Leblanc here, Certified Financial Planner, and today I want to talk to you guys about the first step. What is really essential to start planning for your financial future? Alright, in past videos, I showed you guys the financial planning pyramid. The financial planning pyramid basically is a process that says that you should take care of what is unknown and what it, you have no control over through proper coverage, proper insurance. Once you've taken care of that, you can move on to, with all confidence, move on to what most people consider financial planning, which would be paying off debt and saving for retirement, child education, whatever kind of savings you're looking at doing. And then once all of that's covered, some professionals and wealthy individuals will go on to wealth creation, which is tax savings and special kind of planning. But most, most people just want to retire comfortably and be able to feel confident going forward. But in order to do all this, you need to throw money at it. And that's where your budget comes into play. Your budget really states how much money do you have to work with in order to achieve all these things, right? So a budget is very simple to do. You know, it's not something you have to monitor every paycheck or every month. It's something that you say, okay, well, there's so much coming in there's so much coming out and if I don't have enough to do most of this or some of this or start doing this at the end of the month, if there's nothing left, some of the outs have to go, right? You have to start prioritizing this. So this has to become part of your budget now. So as mentioned, your budget is foundational to knowing how much money you can throw at this. Then you can sit down with a planner and say, all right, I have $400 a month in order to make sure I can retire. Or I only have $200 right now for my whole plan, but you know, later on I'll be able to put more. So without a budget, you can't even have that conversation. And I think that's where the problem lies for most people waiting too long um, in order to start thinking about planning for their future. They say, well, there's no money left. Well, later on, I'll have more, I'll put more. So that's just a vicious cycle of maybe laters, which basically you wake up one day and you're 45 and you have to start planning for your retirement and it becomes much, much harder at that time. So I strongly suggest you consider having a, your own budget so you can start considering some of these. If you have any questions regarding that, visit muscleleven.ca or contact me directly. And remember that my advice is free. And it always will be. Cheers, guys.